What's up, you guys? It's CRC with Street Talk TV, and I'm out here today in front of Ben's Chili Bowl. And I have a guest right here for us today. What's your name, Miss Girl? Natalie. Hey, Natalie. So, are women honest with their fantasies with their partner? No. I feel like we are. Women over the age of 25, we're going to tell you exactly what we want in the bedroom. Everybody under that, we'll let you do whatever you want to do. Act like it feel good. Uh, okay. Like grown women, anybody over 25 and up, I feel like we definitely are honest and open about what we like and what we don't like. I am. Good evening here. It's your boy, Mr. Hood from Street Talk TV. And the first question I got for you, Mr. Gumby is, do you think women are honest about their sexual fantasies with their partner? That their partner, they supposed to be intimate with them to the limit. Yeah, to a limit. So. What you mean to a limit? Is she supposed to Lick your balls, you supposed to lick her booty crack. Like, we need, what's, what's the limit? All that, if that's your woman, go from the rooter to the tutor. From the rooter to the tutor. From the rooter to the tutor. Rooter to the tutor. You heard here first on Speed Talk TV, lick that rooter to the tutor on that Buddha of your girl. I have this beautiful young lady with me here today. What's your name, sweetheart? My name's Christina. Hi, Christina, you're so gorgeous. Thank you, you like yeah. it? you so much. So the first question is, are women honest about their fantasies with their partner? No. Mm, that's a really good question. I believe women are honest about their fantasies with men if they're comfortable or their partner, I'm not going to just say men, if they're comfortable enough with them to be that vulnerable and to release that side of them. But if they're not super comfortable with them, then I don't, I don't see them being super open about what they like and what they don't really like. Yeah. You think there's any real women left in the world? There are a lot of them. How many sexual partners have you had throughout your X amount of years of your life living? I don't know. As far as I know, they're always nice women in this world. They're always nice women. Hey, I got three children. Oh, he got three children, y'all. Three children. That was a long time ago, though, for him. That was probably a long time ago for him. No, no, no. You, you, you. You are talking too much. This is when he get real on street talk. Now he about to have street talking too much. Are you queen enough for the modern day man? No. So I feel as though I bring more to the table than the modern day man. I feel like I need a superman for myself just because of my particular standards that I want in a man. But um, yeah, I feel like I'm queen enough and yeah. <laughs> so you never know a person's story or a person's past or where they're going. So with that in with that in mind, we're gonna thank you, Mr. Neil, for your service like and whatever you did. And oh, you can definitely spit, but I'm gonna sign off and I'm gonna let you spit. I'm Mr. Hood. I'm gonna sign off. I'm gonna let Mr. Neil spit some Street Talk TV. My man Neil gonna bring you a street freestyle because he in the streets, he from the streets, and he know the streets. Here you go, bro. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. About to kick the ballistic like chop leg, knee chop stick, the smooth and then conditioning, heart reasonable, purse working, nerves flirting, dollar.